I've been hacking and whacking and guessing and playing too long with antennas. It's time to get serious, and I'm doing that. I'm going to start analyzing it. I got. I went out and got a Nano VNA. I want to tell you about the one I got and what I think of it. Stick around. I guess, as you know, I build a lot of antennas. And when I say I, I hack and whack, I, I kind of, for analyzation, go on historical values of things that I know how it should work. I research an antenna. And then uh, for SWR, uh, basically what I do is just uh, I'll take the rig itself, uh, you know, one of my Zygu rigs and uh, and run SWR on it and see how it works or whatever. So many people said, man, you, well, you've got to start analyzing these things and do it right. Get a, Get an antenna analyzer. Well, I looked around at antenna analyzers that I really want, but you know what? I really didn't want to spend that kind of money. So what I did was I went and found basically about the cheapest thing I could find. I said, you know what? I want to get familiar with this thing and play with it. I'll go find something inexpensive. And that's a Nano VNA. And the one I bought was roughly 50 bucks. I mean, hey, that's not bad. That's not bad. I'll take it for $50. And, uh, and I'm, I'm satisfied with it. I, I really am. And I, it was worth the purchase and worth the price to buy this thing. And, and that's why I'm doing this video. I don't normally uh, promote products or whatever, but I know it's a lot of times when you buy things, especially inexpensive things, um, you want to know if you get a good one. And there's so many of these flooding the, uh, flooding the, the, I should say the market, you know, the, the online sales things or whatever that um, I wanted to like find one that I wanted spend as little as I can on it and then uh, see if it would work. And I did. I got this one. This is the, I mean, it is tiny. It is not as big as it looks in this picture. It's a tiny little nano in uh, VNA. And the one I got is made by a company called CC. And uh, I'm, I'm pleased with it. I took this thing and there's a lot to learn about these things. I took this thing and I calibrated it for, for seven through 30 megahertz. What i thought I would do is I've got a really, really compromised home antenna here. It's all I can have. I live on the third floor of a, of a condominium building here. So I have a real compromised antenna. And I thought, you know what? I've never, with other than just through the rig itself, hitting SWR and looking at SWR, I've never done a true sweep on this thing. So what I did is I went and watched a couple great videos. There's a lot to these things that, that there's a learning curve. But I went and watched a really couple great videos just to do an SWR sweep. And one thing you, you do, you'd have to, you have to calibrate these pretty much every time you use them. It's not a bad thing because if you think about it, it's a precision instrument. This thing is, um, you know, it, it, it needs calibration. On top of that, outside of, Let's say the uh, the more expensive antenna analyzer. I mean, this thing is truly a, uh, as it says here on the box, a uh, a, a vector network analyzer. <laughs> There's a lot it'll do. Um, two sides. You can run cable through this and look at loss. You can you can analyze cable. There's just I'm sure people are going to put in the comments just a plethora of things you can use this for. To start out with, until I get through the learning curve, mine's probably going to just be SWR sweeps as I'm analyzing antennas. And as I learn a little bit more, I'll use it for other things. But I really like this one, and I, I took it. I, uh, I I followed the videos that I saw that I'll leave a link below. Follow the videos and uh, calibrated this thing, like I said, for, se for through three. No, I'm sorry, seven through thirty megahertz. And then I ran. It was so easy. After that, pop it on. I, I with a an adapter. This thing does. You have to buy some adapters. That I boy, did I put a rig together, but it worked. Um, and this because these things are, uh, as you can see, not uh, 239 or BNC, but I put an adapter together with the wires and everything it came with. It came with everything but the connector for the uh, the very end. Um, but I put it all together, ran a sweep so easy, and it revealed to me exactly what I thought it would reveal. My antenna's a piece of crap, but <laughs> and I knew it. But I did see, I knew, I could even see there uh, in the 20 meter band. I, I, when I put this thing up, I, I actually tuned it for 20 meters. We were in solar minimum then, and that was about the only band that was really uh, popping at the time. This was what, uh, I don't know. 2019-ish or so. So it's been up there about four or five years I've had this antenna up. Never done this true sweep with it. So it's kind of cool. 
to use this thing. So just wanted to do a video and, and, and talk about this thing and, and tell you that, um, yeah, this little, um, little nano VNA, the one I got here from CC, this one works. It works well. I've seen some stories and heard people talk about, uh, horror stories with them. They do make these a, a little bit bigger or whatever. Something I don't normally do. I'm going to put a link to the one I bought in the, uh, in, in the description down below. I don't promote a lot of products. It's not something I, I normally do, but I, um, I just, if you want to get one, it's, it's really inexpensive. And, um, this is the way to start instead of spending, um, you know, 250 to seven, eight hundred dollars on an analyzer, which I probably will eventually one day. But to get started, um, everything that came with this was, uh, is there. I need, I'm probably going to find me a little box or something, a bag or something protective that I can take it out in the field and analyze, uh, antennas with it out there. But, uh, yeah, I'm real pleased with my Nano NVA and I, 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 VNA, I should say, na Nano VNA. I just thought I'd get on here and do a quick video and tell you guys, if you're looking, I found one that works. Um, go check it out. Uh, like I said, the link below, um, if you're thinking about it for 50 bucks, man, it's a deal. And, um, I'm pleased it worked. And, uh, it, just as I expected it, I actually wanted it to, it worked. That's all, guys. Just a quick video. Uh, to, like I said, I don't promote a whole lot of products. And um, the only reason I'm doing this one is because I bought other stuff that was, as we say, Chinese built. And I wasn't successful with it and didn't like it. This was an Amazon purchase. And I got it quick. And uh, and like I said, $50 was well worth it. So link below. Till next time, I'm Walt K4OGO73, my friends.